Hello my lovely viewers and welcome back to another Lunarly unboxing. Uh, this month is December. It's actually December 1st so I'm very excited to open up our December box. Um, I believe it's going to be the cold moon uh, according to some of my friends. We will see. So let's go ahead and open it up. So as always, knife safety. Let's start off over here. smell like some kind of orange, like citrusy smell. And something else, but we'll, we'll find out. So let's open it up. Box. All right. So, oh. Well, um, we got our card. Um, it's a little crinkled, as you can tell. It didn't quite make it safely through delivery. Which is too bad. I like trying to keep my cards as you know, flat as I can, because uh, I like to collect them, but that's, at least the artwork is pretty, look at that, it's really pretty, just, just wish it didn't have all the folds in it, oh, oh, I was right, it is the cold moon, all right, so the, our new moon is December 4th, coming up soon, our first quarter moon is going to be on December 11th, the full moon is going to be December 19th, and the last quarter is going to be December 27th. So the cold moon means that it's time to cuddle up and enjoy self-care. Named after the start of the shiver season, <laughs> that's cute, uh, the cold moon beckons us to stay inside. Use this as a time to nurture yourself and those around you. Shows of warmth are the perfect way to thaw the season's chill. Now, an intention to inspire. I commit to showing my loved ones how much they mean to me. That's nice. Okay. So in this, oh, let's do, let's do the, the candle first. So the candle, champagne, okay, for gratitude and joy, blood orange, that's the citrus I smell, uh, blood orange for serenity and optimism, and kumquat. Oh, I don't recall smelling a kumquat. Yeah, it's, it's I mostly smell the, the blood orange, it's very strong. It smells very good. Uh, so the kumquat for energy and healing. So wrap yourself in the warm glow of champagne, blood orange, and kumquat aromas as you reflect on the dazzling year behind you. Oh. Illuminate shorter days as you welcome winter at your door. This vibrant blend of champagne, blood orange, and kumquat helps you evoke the spirit of the season when festive gatherings are balanced by the quiet of the cold moon. Meditation tip. As you sit in the stillness of this cold moon, summon the fire within to help keep you warm. There is positive energy flowing through you, and when you let your mind shine brightly, you become your own spark. The new moon is there to support you. I like that. All right, so now what's in this box? So we have a bamboo mixing bowl set. All right. So the description is, crafted from fast-growing bamboo, this essential mixing bowl set allows you to care for the earth as you care for skin. Each tool is designed to make your DIY facial feel like a day at the spa. That's gonna be interesting because I've actually never made my own facials. Uh, or like in my own mask that I use. Uh, so it'll be interesting to find out how that works. So instructions are, enjoy the meditative ritual of mixing up uh, your own face mask. Then wash this handy set by hand. Okay, I'm just gonna have to do some research on this uh, to find out if it's okay to continue to use the soaps that I use for my dishes um, for the bamboo set. So I'll do some research on that. So let's find out. It, it's, it's a holding box. Is this the bamboo set? This is not the bamboo set. Okay, um, this one. It's a little box, so it's a uh, hi kitten. Um, got a little brush. You need a spoon to get that little spoon. So let me see if I can pull that out for you. As you can see, itty bitty brush. It looks like it's got a maybe bamboo handle. We'll see. Um, and this itty bitty spoon. Look at that cute little spoon. Okay, and a bowl. It's a nice bowl. Oh, and there's a little knife. 
harp spreader thing. I don't know. Looks like a knife. Itty bitty knife. That's cute. All right. Put all my little oh, things together so you can see how well I can hold them. <laughs> if I can hold them. There we go. Ta da! Little bowl. Oh, they're sweet. Okay. So next up is a new moon charcoal mask. Hey, mask. So the description for this is put a fresh, excuse me, a fresh face to the new moon with a deep cleansing mask. The lavender and charcoal in this botanical face mask powder help remove impurities and reveal a brighter you. So instructions are use this jar to make seven to 12 masks. Wow, all right. Um, and keep it in a cool, dry spot when you're not mixing it up. Once done, you can reuse the jar. So warning, do not mix with metal utensils, not meant for consumption, avoid eye area. So, well, not metal utensils, good news. I've got these now. That's convenient. So let's look at that mask. Okay. So get lavender and charcoal, and it's from a company called Luna Lux Botanicals. So it is all in black though, and it's got itty bitty white handwriting, so that's gonna be a little hard to read. So I'm gonna do my best to try that. Um, directions: mix equal parts powder and water until paste forms. Apply paste to clean face and let sit for 10 minutes or until dry. Rinse mask off and moisturize. This mask powder can also be mixed with the following instead of water. So you can use floral water and, okay. Um, honey, milk, plain yogurt, lemon juice, apple cider vinegar. Caution, do not mix mask with metal utensils, okay. So it is um, organic, small batch, cruelty free and handcrafted, nice. That's our little new moon mask. Okay. All right, what else do we have? Oh, our rock. I like rocks. Um, labradorite gemstone, ooh. Description, let the shimmer of iridescent labradorite shine a, a light on you. Known to lend calm and strength during times of transformation, this powerful gemstone is the one to cling to as time cycles from one year to the next. Instructions, hold the stone in your left hand as you meditate to absorb its positive energy or simply spend a few minutes admiring its radiance anytime you need to shift in spirit. So let's find our rock. It's pretty easy to always find these. There's always gonna be these little wet bags. All right. Now, the one thing that I like about these ones is that they don't come as these shiny, overly polished rocks. Um, although I like those too. They come as their, just their regular form. It's just rocks. Yeah, there's a little bit of shine in these. That's cool. All right, got my little laboratory. And last but not least, that thing that I picked up and I did not know what I was touching, um, moon trinket box. Oh, okay. Um, the description is live by the sun, love by the moon. Let the message etched inside the ceramic trinket box guide you anytime you open it, and the radiating moon on the outside be a reminder to live every day with intention. So the instructions for this are store special trinkets, everyday items, or a written intention you wish to keep. Okay. And it did come in this, like, I like the box. Like, you know, the trinket, you know, container itself, to me, it looks, it's gonna look really nice, but look at that box! description inside. A couple notes to make on this are they have on the bottom here. Uh, it's from a group called Fringe. Uh, decorative use only, not for food. And that's also said that in French and also in Spanish. So and there's the lid. It's the moon. And that's what it's all going to look like together. Like that. And then like that. I'm glad it didn't break in transportation, but oh my god. So that looks like that is going to be it. So I've got my lovely candle. As always, I've got a rack. I have some face 
mask stuff and some stuff to mix up that face mask. And I've got a little container to hold my trinkets, hold my intentions. And then I have another box to hold things. I don't know, I just really like how that box looks. I like the top of that. I hope you all have a wonderful December, no matter what you decide to celebrate. I hope you decide to have a wonderful time, even if there is a lot of issues going on. Actually, there are a lot of issues going on due to everything going on in the world right now, and also because we are losing daylight, and I understand seasonal depression is upon us. Trust me, I understand that very well. So, from my heart to yours, have a wonderful December, and I'll see you all soon.